Hi guys! It's Natalie Sheree and today I just want to talk. Yes, like Sheila, you haven't done that in so long. Yeah. So yes, what do I want to talk about today? So first, I want to talk about what's been going on in my life. Like, I'm not on YouTube 24-7 making videos 24 7 no that is not my life i work at tarjay yes <laughs> i've been working there for the last two months that's why for the last month and a half there haven't been like consistent videos every week like there were the previous two months and that's because i've been working so i haven't had time to like record content for my channel and i didn't just want to throw out any old garbage for you guys to watch I'm just keeping it real so yeah I had to wait till I got time to do it and now I do <laughs> and so let's talk let's talk if you haven't already checked out my video I do have a video on this watch and go if you're wondering so make sure you check that out I will leave the link for that down below and if you haven't checked out you'll just see me just fluffing and like if you haven't noticed, like, the shape of my hair has totally came back. It came back to me. It's because I got a diva cut. Yes, I went to Elise, and she was at the um, Curl Collection. The Curl Collective. Can make, make that correction. The Curl Collective in Chicago. I went to her for my diva cut. And, yes, I am totally in love with it. And yes, for those of you who did not know, um, she's moved salon, so I will leave that info down below, and also I will update it in the description box of that video, so you guys know where to find her. Her link to her website and everything is still the same, so if you go to her website, you will know where she's located. So yeah, I got a diva cut. My mother paid for it. It was $150. I was going to pay for it, but my mother opted to pay for it. So I'm like, why not? That's, much, that's more money in my pocket if she pays for it. So yeah, go mom. So yeah, she paid for that. And when she came down, we also went to a concert. Yes, that was my first time going to a concert. We went to see Tamia, and it was awesome. <laughs> like her performance was amazing like she did her thing i will insert a clip of her some of her performance i'll be by the way performance and I really really enjoyed myself that was my first time going to a concert and my mother took me to it I went with my mother there's us here <laughs> and you guys should feel special because that's her first time smiling in the picture <laughs> my mother never ever ever smiles in a picture even this pictures of us as kids growing up pictures of her with her grandkids she never smiles in a picture and that was it's a moment for me. It was like my mother never smiles in a picture, and it's, and I, I got the first picture of her smiling. So that was pretty cool. And if you're looking here, you're like Sheila. I can't get away from what's going on right here. Here, yes. If you can see, I have a septum ring, and I got this from um, a boutique that is on Instagram. I cannot remember the name of the boutique 
right offhand, but I will leave it like whoop right here. Blink, 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 blink. Yes, I'll leave it right there and I will also leave it in the description box on where I got it from. It was super duper cheap. <laughs> like super duper cheap and I'm in love with it. But it pains me to say that my, my husband and my mother and my even my daughter and my son, like nobody else likes it. They're like, no, you are not wearing that in public. You are not going out with me with that in your nose. Like, no. My daughter said, Mommy, you got a booger in your nose. I'm like, what are you talking about? I got a booger in my nose. It's right there. I was like, baby, that's not a booger. That is not a booger. That's a beauty mark. <laughs> okay. For real, for real, for real. For real. They hate it. Like, seriously hate it. So, yeah, what else? So, my son just turned one. He turned one on September the 19th. I was like... No, he didn't just, just turn one, but yeah. He's one now. He turned one on September the 19th. My daughter is about to be four. She'll be four on December the 23rd. And I don't know what to do. Like, right now, I think we're going to go um, to the bowling alley. And at our bowling alley, they have, like, a jump, the jumping trampoline type aerobics <laughs> type thing. So, I'm thinking we're going to do that. So, that way the kids and the adults um have fun i experienced my first chicago snow and i had to work that night so i had to drive home at 11 o'clock at night after 11 because first i had to get this buy everything in this in the store to get through the first snow i had to buy a shovel i had to buy the snow brush for the car i had to buy the icer i didn't have I don't have hats, I don't have gloves, I don't have a scarf. <laughs> like I didn't have anything. I was not prepared and nobody told me I had to do all this. They said it was coming, but they never said, okay, prepare yourself for it. You you want to need stuff. And that's about it for today. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, if you have any ideas on videos that you would like to see me do any styles any wash and go combinations of that sort that's not too pricey let me add that yes i do like to spend money on my hair but if it's not at ulta or target where i can take the product back to the store if i don't like it i'm not buying it i'm sorry you guys it's just not in my budget i got a daughter that's about to turn four like I said, two parties. <laughs> Christmas is two days after her birthday. I just ain't got no budget to be spending money like that. So just keep that in mind when you write down below what products you want to see me try. So yeah, just write them down below if it's a style. Like I do plan on doing a braid out um, like I did with my transitioning hair. Um, the same technique and everything but I want to try it out with my hair being fully natural because when I was um transitioning you guys know that was my go-to style a twisting curl like that or a braid out and curl er day <laughs> that was me every day and I loved it I did but yeah I want to do that and I also want to do this I guess it's a flat twisting curl that I've been seeing going around and it's where they use the prime rod and like they twirl it but it's like they do like I would say about eight to ten flat twists around so I am going to go take off take all this off because I have to go to work and I don't go to work with a beast face I'm sorry but yeah that is all I will talk to you guys later maybe Hmm. I might do another shitty shitty chat chat video probably at the end of this year so we can see where we're gonna go from here with my channel so I will talk to you guys then later dolls